Hey guys, Carrie here. Thanks for stopping by again. I'm um, just here to do an update on my latest appointment and some new additions to my lovely journey here uh, with reversing this extraction orthodontic case. I got uh, four molar bands yesterday and a thicker wire. I think they called it an 017. I don't know if that means anything to you. I know there are some dentists that follow my page, so I'm trying to be as specific as I can on this. Now, next time I go, I'm definitely going to have to get a TADS because there's no other way to keep my wisdom teeth. So really not looking forward to that. I don't know if you guys have seen how much fun it is to get a TADS, on a TADS online here, but oh well. Uh, they moved this spring. And I have to tell you that with the new molar bands and with the thicker wire, I feel like a horse just kicked me in the mouth. And last night, I must have taken between then and now, I've taken about 12 Tylenols. And every four hours, I'm like getting another one right away. So anyway, let me show you what they've done. Um, there used to be a spring in here and in here. And they moved it back to the proper position where it should be here behind the first molar and the first molar. I also got the molar bands. Cool thing is, you know, back in the day when I originally had the stupid braces that messed up my whole face, um, the molar bands went all the way around the molar. Now they kind of just glue on like everything else. They're really a lot less invasive than I remember. So here, let me show you inside. It's pretty good in comparison to um, how it looks with the molar band on there, like the ones that go all the way around, I meant, because I had them with that expander. Oh, thank God, I don't have that anymore. But anyway, here we go. The other thing is, it's only been a day since they moved the spring, and I can already see a little gap coming back in here. So looking forward to that, and I can go back in as soon as two weeks to get the tads added, but I have never been in this much pain um, in like forever, so I'm not really looking forward to jumping right back. Hopefully tomorrow or the next day I'll feel better, um, but yeah, as of right now, that's it. Uh, oh, the other thing is there's a, um, I'll try to, there's a little bend in the wire in between my two front teeth. I think that that's going to help. He said this wire will help turn these um, incisor teeth because they were kind of turned in and it was kind of hard to bite in there. Oh, anyway, you guys can see I have uh, open bite or pretty much overbite. That's because they're making rooms so they can open the lowers next. A lot of dentists, if you looked at my um, my different, I don't know if I actually did one on that, but there was a couple of opinions I had where they just couldn't even open the lower. So um, the reason they're um, holding that uh, um, open by it is so there's room to open the lower. And then I guess I'm going to have to wear rubber bands to bring it back together or whatever. I guess that would be that step. But anyway, here I am. And that's where I am now. Um, anybody has any questions, just feel free to let me know. And I'll come back and let you know when I have another update. Have a wonderful night. Thanks for watching. Aloha.